Good morning, everyone. I'm Riley King, and welcome to this morning news report right here on the Riley King Network. Let's begin. Boulder mass shooting victims remembered, including police officer, future grandpa. My heart aches today. I think all of our does as Colorado begins as American. They were community residents going about their normal routine of shopping at a grocery store, unaware that it would be the last act of their lives. Among the victims were a 25-year-old grocery store worker who was raised by her grandparents to be a strong and independent and a 61-year-old man who will never be able to see or hold his expecting grandchild. The names of the nine civilians and one police officer killed in Monday's mass shooting at the King Soup store in Boulder, Colorado, were released on Tuesday, just hours after the last body was removed from the supermarket. I don't know all the details at this time. I've spoken to some of their families, and I can just tell you that they're heartbroken, and this is the worst call you could ever receive as a family member, Boulder Police Chief said at a news conference. Among those fatally shot was Officer Eric Halley, 51, a father of seven, who was the first officer to respond to the store when 911 calls about the shooting came in. Boulder Police Chief said Tally was shot when he rushed into the store to save lives and engage the suspect in a gun fight. Here, her voice choked with emotion as the police chief read the names of the other nine victims. The youngest, 20, and the oldest, 65. <laughs> Sorry about that. Here are the names of the victims, as you can see right here. Colorado Governor said the victims were people of all ages who started their day with a cup of coffee or reading the morning paper, perhaps getting their kids ready and putting on a winter coat to go out. None of them expected that this would be their last day here on the planet, the governor said at a news conference. A simple run for milk and eggs, you know, getting ready to shop, going in a regular way, we all lead our lives. Something that we can all identify with led to a complete tragedy here. The senseless tragedy hit close to home. He said he lives in the community and has shot at the King Super's store. My heart aches today. And I think all of ours does as Coloradians, as Americans, for this senseless tragedy of loss of life, the governor said. Here's what we know about the victims so far. Officer Eric Talley. Take a look.
the next victim. The next victim. And the other. And that does it for this morning news report right here on the Riley King Network. Thank you for watching this morning news report on the Riley King Network. I hope you all have a good rest of your day. See you back here later on today for another news report. Goodbye, everyone.